What is going on, you guys? It is Baxton, and we are back. Uh, Chainsaw Man, episode 10, came out yesterday. I was going to do it yesterday, but something came up, so I wasn't able to do it yesterday. So we're doing it right now. Um... Yeah, I don't really have much to say. Nothing really going on my going on in my life. Nothing new. So with that being said, let's just hop right into Chainsaw Man. So last episode, um, oh fuck, hold on. Uh, Makima. Okay, and see, I came prepared. I have the names on my phone because I always, always forget names. Okay, so Makima. <laughs> Her ability is fucking crazy. Okay, I think in the yeah, uh, I, yeah, it was the last episode that we got to see her power. Um, in the last episode, I said that her ability gives me like a Death Note type of vibe, where obviously, um, you go back to Death Note, Light, aka Kira, um, obviously with the Death Note. You have to know the person's name and see them with your own eyes in order to be able to put their name in the death note and kill them. I get that kind of vibe from Makima because she lined up, what was it? Uh, I forget the number, but a bunch of prisoners. And it seemed like she wasn't able to do use her ability at all unless one of these prisoners said a certain name and then she could kill that person by sacrificing the prisoner's life. Does that make sense? So like, I'm the prisoner. She says, hey, say this name. I say the name, and then I die. But she's able to kill the person, that named person. It kind of, yeah, like, you guys get kind of get what I'm saying? It kind of gives me that, like, Death Note type of vibe. But, uh, holy fuck, that's broken. <laughs> Her ability is fucking sick. So nasty. And then, uh, where is she? Uh, Kobani? Kobani? I know she's a crybaby. But holy fuck. She went off last episode. What a way to end the episode. Oh, man. So... Let's uh, let's see if Denji gets it in. Let's see if he can finally get laid or get a get a kiss from Makama, Makima, Makima. Okay, Chainsaw Man. Episode 10. 3, 2, 1. Mm, turn down the volume. <laughs> you got those feet up on the bed. Those are weird things to put an apple in. They're all mine. They're going to fall onto the bed. Division four. Yonko, he said. Does Yonko mean four? I mean... that I, That's a stupid question.
four emperors. Yeah. His ability is fucking sweet. <coughs> and I was saying I kind of get that Death Note vibes and then there's apples. There's apples everywhere. It's got no, yeah, damn, that sucks, oh, it did light, I was gonna say, that sucks, that's one of the worst things, oh, oh no, he's just remembering now. And it was her that got him on smoking in the first place. That got him. Oh, man. And he doesn't feel anything. <laughs> wow. I don't even think he would. That's what I mean, you'd be down. Yeah. melancholy oh oh man what's the news what are you game nope oh Damn. I don't know what to say. That's... That sucks. Damn, man. Waking up and forgetting that your partner died? Especially one that literally, like, 
I mean, it's kind of safe to say. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Yeah, it, I don't know. It was pretty obvious that... I I would say that she was in love with Aki. I mean, let's be honest. I, like, I don't even know if he even knew that. But fuck, man, that's... You wake up, you totally forget, and then all of a sudden it's like, oh yeah, she's dead. Oh, stay alive and you can cry for me. And he's crying for her. They're honest. Division one teacher, so that's what you're going to call me. Testing their strength somehow. Oh, he broke their necks. Huh. Yeah. Ah, yes! Whoa! <laughs> this is sick. Oh, man, you guys better run now. You guys better get out of there now. Okay, okay. <laughs> the speed! Three hits like nothing! Ah! 
<laughs> right through the fucking <laughs> Yeah, easy. <laughs> Holy shit. Mostly immortal. Holy fuck. You two have no rights here. My toys locked because I was too strong. Holy fuck. Stabbed him through the <laughs> It came out the top of his brain. Oh fuck. Wait, wait. Marky Mark? No, 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 no. What the fuck is going on? They just got worked all day. <laughs> As she's just...
of wits. <laughs> I'm feeling smarter already. <laughs> you as well? <laughs> With a hundred plans. They're getting real close. They're going to become real buddies. For real. Oh, here we go. This is where the wits kick in. The scent of this blood. I have a feeling he's going to know about, like, yo, this guy's no chump. He's going to know something right away. Right through the eye, right through the hole. Oh, he knows though. Watch this. Whoa, what a fucking dodge. <laughs> she can control it though, right? Whoa! Yo, this guy is solid. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, you're about to get worked. Yep. Ooh! Bam! Damn, guys! That's it. He showed up and now he's leaving. <laughs> Powie. <laughs> Powie. Holy shit. Yo! Right after he said, we're done for today. What kind of weapon? Oh. Let's choose a weapon. It's like John Wick. He goes in, show me what you got. I'm here for a tasting. Partner's younger. She gave me a letter. So it, oh, okay. So it was her sister that showed up. Oh, no. Fuck. I have a feeling what it's... Is it going to be like, I, like I, an I love you type of note? sending food or anything dad's been messaging me i appreciate your concerns but i'm more worried about him is he taking his meds <laughs> whoa 
How do I get Aki to quit? I don't think it's a good idea to keep to keep working here. If nothing else, we could go to a private instead of da 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 da. Yo. future devil I had a feeling. Come on. That went way too fast. Okay, hold on. I'm going to go back real quick because I, I want to read quickly what that letter. Okay, so, wait a sec, wait a sec, I gotta go back even further. Okay, she was my partner's younger sister. Okay. Fuck off. She gave me a letter. Okay. His partner's sister gave her a letter. This is a letter. A letter that she sent to her. I'm leaving. I think you should read it. So this is meant for her. Okay. So they're talking about their father. Is dad being okay? The job... The job pays pretty well. So don't worry about sending food or anything. Dad's been messaging me lately. I appreciate his concern. But I'm worried... Mo I'm more worried about him. Is he taking his meds? To her. And then she said, I forced Aki to get his ear pierced. If nothing else, we could go private instead of staying in public safety. How do I get Aki to quit? I brought it up, but he just brushed it off. So she wanted Aki to quit. And go private. I don't... I don't think it's a good idea to keep working here. If nothing else, we could go private instead of, yeah. How do I get Aki to quit? I brought it off, but he just brought I was trying to be serious, too. Okay, so basically she sent him a letter wanting him to quit. And asking their, about their dad. So. She wanted to go private with him, I guess. And she wanted him to quit, but he brushed it off. I'm trying to... 
I'm trying to get like the the meaning behind this. Is it kind of kind of trying to say like, oh, if you quit, like if you did quit, you both would be in private and she would still be alive right now? Or like kind of like in a way like, oh, if I listen to her, like say I'm, say I'm Aki and it's like, oh, if I listened to her, yeah, we could both still be alive and working in a private sector. So is that note kind of making him feel guilty now about not quitting? Because, I mean, that's that's whatever, right? Because he's... He, he's basically seeking revenge, right? So, he was going to go, I think, go do this anyways. And knowing that, I like... What was the purpose of that letter? Am I just dumb? Because... It's just like, when is he going to quit? I tried to, I forced him to get his ear pierced. So it's like, she's like writing back and forth to her sister about him. Like she's in a lot of the letters or he's in a lot of the letters. Maybe the fact that he, maybe he was surprised when he read that, uh, she forced him to get his ear pierced. The fact that she was even mentioning him in the letters. Is that why he was like, oh, like, because. Because, I mean, even if he didn't get this is what I mean, even if he didn't get this letter and or didn't read it at all, he would still be doing what he's doing right now. That's what I feel like. So, like, the letter's not pointless. I just don't. Like get it And then look at his facial expression right there. I forced him to get his ear pierced. And then look at that expression. If nothing else, we could go private instead of staying in public safety. If nothing else, what do you mean if nothing else? Because she would just ask about the meds. About their father. If nothing else, we could go private instead of staying in public safety. How do I get Aki to quit? I brought it up. So they wanted to go private. This is this is what I'm saying. Fuck off. I don't know. That was a sick episode. I, th that whole letter. Someone explain that to me. Because obviously it has some significance. I just can't like right away initially think of something of importance of that letter. Um, and then there's this guy.
Okay, I was about to figure out his name, but they don't reveal his name yet. Yeah, okay, yeah, his name is, right. Hi, my name is, my name is, <clears throat> wow, so, this guy fucked up Denji and Power so bad. Now, when Makima originally, Makima, Makima, when she originally, oh, fuck, when she originally said he'll be training you, you know he's tough, man. Right away, you get that vibe. He's got a fucking scar on his face. He worked them so bad. I know he didn't pull his cord and turn into Chainsaw Man, but like... Man, they got worked real bad. And then this demon that Aki is going to see. You just see that little eyeball. I don't know. Damn. And then we got what? Two more episodes, I think? Fuck off. Go back. Twelve episodes, yeah. So we got we got two more. This went by so fast. We got two more episodes. Oh, this is gonna end with a bang, man. I got a feeling. The way that this third last episode, oh man. Oh man, this is gonna be awesome. Well, yep, yeah, that's it, guys. Um, yeah, I mean, nothing really else to say. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, thank you guys for tuning in, and I will see you guys soon. Peace.